Hi, I'm Maria Smilios, Director of Nursing for Maternal Child Services at Flushing Hospital. I'm here to talk to you about putting your baby to sleep and keeping your baby safe when your baby is put to sleep. The American Academy of Pediatrics recently released guidelines and I'd like to share them with you. What we're trying to do is to prevent sudden infant death syndrome. Many babies die each year and it can be prevented. We always want to make certain that the baby is sleeping alone, not in the bed with you. And we would have a bassinet or a crib with a firm mattress and make certain that we don't have any loose clothing, blankets in that bed, no stuffed animals in that bed. Notice how I've wrapped my baby here. The arms are exposed and I always put my baby back to sleep on their back, not allowing the baby to be placed on the side and certainly not on their tummy. When we place a newborn baby on their tummy, they don't have the ability to raise their neck. This happens later on as the neck muscles strengthen. For now, when the baby is awake, you can have supervised tummy time, not leaving your baby alone, allowing them to get used to moving and moving their head. But until then, we always keep our baby on their back. Another tip is don't allow your baby to take naps in a reclining type of chair or napping in your arms, always putting the baby on their back. Certainly in the car seat, they may fall asleep, but that's the only time they should be in that position. Always putting their baby or putting your baby in a bassinet or putting your baby in the crib to sleep. These are some of the tips that I want you to abide by. Very important that you start doing that in the hospital and as well when you go home. If you have any questions, please ask your pediatrician or certainly you can contact us here at Flushing Hospital. We have an ambulatory care center that has a pediatric department as well. We look forward to helping you and wish you the best with your baby.